Collectively, the world's 10 highest-paid athletes raked in $992 million over the last 12 months, according to Forbes estimates. That represents a 6% drop from 2021. This year's collective total is the third highest ever, behind 2021's $1.05 billion and the $1.06 billion total of 2018 off the field. The top 10 athletes hauled in an estimated $500 million from endorsements, appearances, memorabilia, and licensing fees. As well as the cash returns from businesses they operate and equity stakes they sold. That's nearly flat from last year's record $512 million. Here, we take a look at the top six richest athletes in the world in 2022. Number 6, Kevin Durant, $92.1 million. Brooklyn Nets star Kevin Durant brings in roughly $28 million annually from Nike, a sneaker deal surpassed only by LeBron James among active players. He has recently added deals with Coinbase, NBA Top Shot and Weed Maps, but with media company Boardroom and investment firm 35 Ventures, his business empire goes far beyond endorsements. NFT platform OpenSea and digital fitness startup Future are among his latest investments, and he is backing SeatGeek's SPAC merger. Durant and his longtime business partner, Rich Kleiman, also announced last year that they would launch a SPAC of their own, it is still seeking an acquisition. Number 5, Steph Curry, $92.8 million. No NBA player made more in salary this season than Stephen Curry, and the Golden State Warriors guard is due for a raise after signing a four-year, $215 million extension last August. He'll make roughly $48 million on the court next season, rising to just under $60 million in 2025-26. Curry's new FTX endorsement deal also came with an equity stake, and he dived deeper into blockchain in December. Releasing a collection of NFTs that featured his sneakers and were tied to three metaverse platforms. Meanwhile, Curry's production company, Unanimous Media, signed a development deal with Comcast NBC Universal in September. Number 4, Neymar Jr., $95 million. Neymar scored his 400th career goal in November, but like Lionel Messi, he was stung by criticism after Paris Saint Germain's early Champions League exit. His attention will now shift to the World Cup in Qatar this fall, which he has said could be his last. Off the field, he has a valuable set of endorsements, including Puma and Red Bull, and he is the subject of a new Netflix docuseries, Neymar, The Perfect Chaos. He is also diving into the world of NFTs, signing with the platform Anthstar in November and spending over $1 million on two Bored Ape Yacht Club NFTs in one day in January. Number 3, Cristiano Ronaldo, $115 million. Like his rival Lionel Messi, Cristiano Ronaldo has had a disappointing first season with his new team. Much of Ronaldo's earning power comes from his massive social media presence. He has 690 million followers across Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, giving him leverage to demand sky-high rates from sponsors such as Nike, Herbalife, and Clear Shampoo. He is also an investor in Tatel Restaurants, including a new location in Beverly Hills, and is the face of Zuju GP, a forthcoming app aiming to be a digital soccer community. Number 2 LeBron James, $121.2 million LeBron James' Los Angeles Lakers missed the playoffs this season, but he's never been so dominant off the court. He starred in last year's Space Jam, a new legacy and recently moved his talk show, The Shop, from HBO to YouTube. In October, he sold a significant minority stake in Spring Hill, the production company behind both projects, at a valuation of about $725 million, pushing his net worth to $850 million. According to Forbes estimates, after announcing an endorsement deal with Crypto.com in January, James appeared in a Super Bowl commercial next to a computer-generated version of his younger self. Number 1 Lionel Messi, $130 million Lionel Messi's $20 million a year partnership with Socios adds to an endorsement portfolio that includes Adidas, Budweiser, and PepsiCo. He also became Hard Rock International's first athlete brand ambassador in a deal announced last June. 
helping Messi draw level with Manchester United's Cristiano Ronaldo with his off-field earnings for the first time since 2013. Messi won the Ballon d'Or in 2021 as the world's best men's soccer player, but he has had a tougher time on the pitch more recently. Scoring just 9 goals in 32 appearances for Paris Saint-Germain after notching 38 in 47 games in his final season for Barcelona. But while PSG flamed out in the Champions League's round of 16, the club captured the French League 1 title in Messi's first season. The sporting circuit is one that pays in big numbers. If you could become an athlete, which sport would you go for and why? Let us know in the comments below.